When you drop those off, come to the jukebox. I want to introduce you to somebody. Ashley Judd starts in Bug, the creepy crawly adaptation of the off-Broadway play, which finds her character singing into madness trapped in her live-in hotel with her lover, convinced there are bugs burrowing into their bodies. Surprisingly, Ashley didn't bug out, imagining these insects were making themselves right at home, but spent a large majority of the movie scratching. Well, we do that in the film, you know, it's, it's we become increasingly convinced that we are physical persons are infested with bugs and so scratching was a natural reaction to that. Well, you know, the bugs are an imagined phenomenon in the movie and so it didn't really alter um, my relationship to bugs. I like bugs. I'm grateful for them. They feed birds. Um, some of them are very helpful in the garden and I try to have a lot of respect for all forms of life. So I don't have a problem with bugs. Harry Connick Jr. is pretty scary as Ashley's abusive ex-con boyfriend who tries to come back into her life when he's released from prison. She says she didn't bug out in the scene where he punches her in the face. Yeah, any time that there's a stunt involved, it's very carefully rehearsed and everyone has the opportunity to voice their concerns and everyone stays really safe. That was a great day. We had a lot of fun. I was really... Um, moved by doing that scene. It was exactly the kind of thing that I lived for in acting school, you know, to be opposite, a very spontaneous, um, very relaxed, real actor, and just being able to use the space and see what happens is a lot of fun. Ashley is currently shooting Crossing Over based on a true story as an attorney representing a seven-year-old Nigerian girl lost within the immigration services bureaucracy who spent two years in the juvenile detention system when her mother abandoned her for fear of deportment. Bug, directed by William Friedkin, is currently playing in theaters. We'll never really be safe again.